Hi everyone, it's Madam Addicts and Yaz, hear me out. And we're doing something totally different today. We're gonna to talk really fast, just kidding. We are doing <laughs> two minute women. And if you want the rest yes. of the conversation, you've gotta to come to our lives. This is called the quickie, guys, the quickie. So today's topic is gonna to be, I'm not the sum of my parts. Like just what you see isn't all that you get. And just what you see, it's not all there is. There's a lot that goes on beyond this below the surface. Absolutely, and I tend to think that sometimes, like, if you're a very confident person and you tend to dress a little more provocatively right. or exposing more parts of your body than other people, you get kind of lumped into a right. box, and some people project their own insecurities onto that, and it may be that they feel that you're outwardly sexual right. or uh, hyper provocative or mm -hmm. um, sending the wrong message. But you I, get typecast. Yeah, I absolutely. mean, even just being more voluptuous, having bigger bosom, me and the person that likes to go around braless means that every time I wear a shirt, you're gonna see some cleavage. They're, the girls are showing. People have a tendency to think that you have big boobs. There's a sexualization. My boobs are not all that there are to me. I can't help the size of my wife. I guess you can't help the size of your boobs. But you, they, your boobs are your boobs. Yeah, you were. They're just what you have. It doesn't mean that I that they're here for everybody to and be everybody's mine, sex. Mine is the opposite. I happen to have a rounder back That's side, right. and mm -hmm. I do get a lot of comments. Yeah, booty. I do, and a lot of people tend to, uh, which is weird because I grew up in a generation where it was not cool to have right. a butt until like Kim Kardashian right. came around because I was actually. Uh, I was a little bit, I was made fun of actually for having a big ass like mm -hmm. growing up, but it's weird. The white girl with the booty. Yeah, but so now, same thing, you get sexualized a lot right. for having certain um, body parts that you're like, well, it's just how I'm built, but. Um, exactly. I think that. I understand where people are coming from because you know, you see something and it's like, wow, in your face and it is your instinctive reaction to look at them a certain way. But we have to keep in mind that everything's not on the surface that there are real people out there. What, just because someone has a bigger chest means that they should not wear certain things. Those things might make them feel well, they look good, they're sexier. Or they like who they are. But it doesn't mean that that's all there is. So if you want more of this conversation, you're definitely gonna have to follow us to our lives and come to our YouTube channel. Yeah, Madam Madison, Madison yes, yes, hear me out. out. Our lives are going on Instagram, so check us out on Madam Maddox's Instagram, and you can engage in some of the topics with us. We want to hear exactly what you have to say. We want we want to be in real time with you guys. All right, this was our quickie. All right, take care. Bye. Two minutes, and we're done.